Hey, what's up guys? I'm Gunnix here and welcome back to a brand new video here on the channel or if it's your first time here, welcome. So today I'd like to talk about Banished Scarabs and if we could potentially see them in future Halo Infinite campaign DLC since as you would know if you've played their campaign already, there aren't any Banished Scarabs to be seen at all, not even a wreckage of one. So it begs the question, will we see Banished Scarabs in future DLC? Well, as far as I know, there has been some concept art done of a Banished Scarab for Halo Infinite, but of course, as we all know, concept art doesn't necessarily mean that something is going to be in the game, it's just concept art after all. As far as I know, if you don't count Halo Wars 2, the last time a Scarab has been in a Halo game is Halo Reach. So it's been about 12 years this year since we've seen a Scarab in a FPS Halo game. For some reason that sounds unreal and I'm sort of doubting myself there because that just seems like too long but I guess there hasn't been many FPS Halo releases since Reach so it does make sense. But still 12 years is a long time and it would be great if 343 did bring back the Scarab in future Halo Infinite DLC, a banished Scarab specifically as it definitely would be cool to see one of them in a first person perspective. What's interesting to think about when it comes to the Banished Scarabs is how will they look in Halo Infinite if they were to be introduced in future DLC? Because as we've all noticed, or as you may have noticed, all the Banished vehicles that we have in Halo Infinite right now, like the Ghost, Wraith, Banshee, Chopper and Phantom, are different compared to their designs in Halo Wars 2. Like they're a lot more watered down in my opinion. I don't know why these sorts of changes were made to how the banished vehicles look, but honestly I don't mind the changes and it would be interesting to see how banished scarabs will look with Halo Infinite's art style too. Will they look similar? Will they look more watered down? Will they look better? Who knows? Be sure to let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. There is this concept art here, and sorry for the quality of the screenshot, this is a photo someone has taken of the Art of Halo Infinite book, the book this concept art came from, and it's not a close-up, so it's not the 100% best shot, but in this image you can get sort of an idea of how the Banished Scarab could potentially look, and again, this is just concept art, and it was probably done very early on, but this is an official bit of concept art and that's what's interesting too, is that this is a different design to the Halo Wars 2 Scarab. It's a lot less bulky and more resembles the shape of a Scarab we could recognise from the older games. The legs are noticeably thinner and just the whole structure of it is pretty different. It would be interesting to see how the final design of Banished Scarabs are, when or if they do eventually come. If it's not in the next DLC, it will definitely be in a future one since Halo Infinite does have a 10 year plan after all, so anything can happen. That there is the end of today's video. Do you think we could see Banished Scarabs in future Halo Infinite DLC? Maybe even the next one? Be sure to let me know down in the comments below. And if you did enjoy this discussion theory type video, be sure to like, comment and subscribe for more of this sort of content or just Halo content in general. Alright, so thanks for watching, I'll see you guys next time, bye bye.